In a, in a nutshell, it's, um, it's a class where we take um, materials and we turn them into finished products and we teach the students um, a safe way to do that. The majority of what they do is hands-on and working with power tools and we teach them how to safely use the tools and basically turn different types of materials, whether they be wood, metals, plastics, into finished products that they may purchase. Basically, we start as if they know nothing about the equipment, and that's the way we have to approach a class like this. Some students have had some experiences with tools uh, or processes, but uh, most have not. So we start from zero, and we teach the students not only the parts of the machine, but how to safely operate a piece of equipment that uh, is involved in a project that then they follow up with. So they learn about it, they watch me do it, and then they actually practice and put into practice what I've shown them. I would say about 25% is traditional instruction where I'm leading a discussion or a, a lesson in front of the class and then the other 75% of the time is work time in the lab practicing what we talked about. Manufacturing processes, there are no prerequisites. You know, it's, it's open to 9 through 12, and I get pretty much that, that entire spectrum. I'll get seniors and I'll also get freshmen. Again, we're always starting from each, each lesson as if they know nothing about the equipment. So we're starting from zero, whether they're a senior or whether they're a freshman. Well, the big thing is application. It gives them application to the math, the geometry, the things that they're learning in their other classes, and now they can see how that geometry applies and how they can use it in a class like this. Um, you know, all of a sudden they're using Pythagorean's theorem and they didn't realize that it applied outside of mathematics. So it really gives them a, a real life application to the other things that they're learning in class, and um, we just supplement those things that they've already learned in other classes as well. The students that take this course are going to take away basic power tool knowledge and how to, how to operate any of the equipment that you see behind me. Um, so it's going to apply to any, any situation, whether maybe they have their own house one day and they're cutting trim for a house. Well, at least they've had the exposure to how to run, operate a chop saw or a, a miter saw. So great stuff that, that they can use the rest of their life.